Hi, my name is Rafał Seredyński. I am researcher in the Department of Physiology, Wrocław Medical University, Poland. Hi, my name is Bartomiej Paleczny. I am the head of laboratory for research on cardiopulmonary reflexes at the Department of Physiology, Wrocław Medical University. Our team is flattered to have our recent work featured as editor's pick in the March issue of Experimental Physiology. The paper is co-authored with Dr. Katarzyna pawłowska seredyńska from the Human Biology Department, University of Wrocław, and Professor Beata Ponikowska, Head of the Physiology Department, Wrocław Medical University. In the last few years, we have learned a lot about the fascinating connections between gut microbiota and cardiovascular physiology of the host. However, our understanding of the contribution of gut microbes to respiratory control remains very limited. It has been shown recently in rats that the depletion of gut microbiota attenuates the ventilatory response to transient hypoxia, which might suggest the involvement of peripheral chemoreceptors. We aim to check if such a link could be unveiled in humans, but with one caveat, instead of antibiotic treatment and microbiota depletion, we decided to do the opposite thing, to stimulate gut fermentation with lactulose. Gut fermentation intensity was quantified with the hydrogen breath test, and the transient hypoxia test was used to evaluate peripheral chemoreflex sensitivity. Both tests were performed right before and two hours after the test meal. We found that the lactulose meal, compared to placebo, caused modest, yet statistically significant increase in the minute ventilation and breathing rate responses to hypoxia. Importantly, the magnitude of these responses positively correlated with the brief hydrogen content, a proxy for the gut fermentation intensity. Taking advantage of our experience in studying peripheral chemoreceptor function in humans, we have managed to highlight possible new link between gut microbiota and cardiopulmonary function that, in our opinion, deserves further investigation. There are so many aspects to explore the exercise physiology, high altitude adaptation, the clinical implications, and we truly hope that our study will proper further research in this promising area. So, Take care of your internal garden and thank you very much for watching.